Hi guys, this is Emily Fallon's being cameraman today. Or cameraman, whatever you want to call it. But um today we are going to make the beaded zipper. This is actually this one is the beaded zipper we found can zoom in or something. Um this one was with hemp and these silver beads. I made it at my cousin's house because she has hemp. Haley, shh, be quiet. <laughs> um but this one is with string and the beads I have. So you can see like it's not as cool looking because when it's like this, it has hemp, and then this one's just string, so it's thick, it's thinner. We're making the one with string today, okay? Basically, what you're gonna want to do, you're gonna get four strings, okay? You wanna get two shorter ones and two longer ones. See? Difference with this. You're gonna take the two longer ones, pull them off to the side like this. See? You can take the two shorter ones right next to each other like this, okay? You want it to be nice and tight, and you're gonna pull it back on the back of your clipboard or whatever you're using to hold it down. I use a clipboard because it's easier just to hold it down. I'm, I don't have any tape, so right now I'm just using a sticker. Okay? Just simpler. <laughs> so, I'm gonna move this all the way. What you wanna do, if you're doing it with beads, you're gonna wanna pick out a bead right here. Pillbox, full of dreams. Okay? Fill in what color should I do today? Like blue, maybe green? I'm gonna do blue. Do light blue. You're gonna get whatever color you want. And what I do is I like the end of the string. Like you would to thread a needle. And you wanna slide a bead, one bead onto each longer string. And sometimes it's hard to get the bead on. <laughs> what are you laughing at? <laughs> the hell? God, I can't get this on today. End up refilming this like the millionth time. I hate beads today. <laughs> they hate me. Wait, wait, wait. Maybe. <laughs> no. Mm -hmm. Try a different bead. That one's being stubborn. There we go. That's better. Sco or, that's Fallon's dog. Really? His name is Scotch. You get out of here. Okay. Yeah. Oh boy. Okay. You need to. Okay. Mm -hmm. Up here. Okay. You're gonna want to put um yeah, like I said, you're gonna wanna put one bead on each long string. Oh my god. Scotch, seriously, get out of here. Here we go. Oh god dang. I almost swore there. <laughs> okay. Scott, calm down. So calm, dude, out of here. Get out. It's okay. Can you go like Fallon, you're like aiming you bad, bad, what the bad place. <laughs> Stop it, Scott. Okay, just ignore him, okay? Let's do the video. Okay, Fallon. You want to videotape this, not me. Okay, okay. okay. Now that you've strung the two beads on, I know it'd be kind of hard because I have blue. I painted my clipboard blue because I'm before. Now that you've got the two beads on, you know, take down. You might want to actually be on the same side as me, actually, Fan. You might want to go over here. So they're, they're facing the same way as me. Okay. You got your two, two strings over here, two long ones. You got a bead on each. You're going to take the one, the first one on the left and make it so it looks like a four, okay? It's called, I call it a four knot, okay? You're going to take the other one, you pull it over this little tab right here. You're going to take the end, you slip it underneath the tab and the strings in the middle, so it comes out in the middle of the four. You wanna pull them nice and tight up here. And now that you've done that, you wanna do it the other end. Make sure it's like looks like a backwards four, because if you do it like like this one over and over again, it'll curl. It'll curl. So you wanna do the a backwards four now and do the same thing. Pull it over the tab and pull it under here. Do this. So nice tab there, and then you're gonna string on the next beads. Your next two beads. I'm not gonna do it. I'm just gonna show you guys this. And I'm not found. Okay. Um, I'm not gonna take all the time to show you this. So let's pretend we're all done now. Okay. Blah blah blah. blah. Okay. Now we're done. Pretend it goes all the way down to here. Okay. Like this. And what you're gonna do. Take all on you know un untape this. 
So you've got all four strings. You're gonna take a bigger bead. This is just this is the way I like to do it. You're gonna take a bigger bead and slide on all four strings, and then knot it here. And then you've got this. And if you wanted to, I actually did it wrong. I accidentally cut it. You could have kept it instead of cutting it at the end. You could have taken like two strings and just had them like doubly long and had them looped like that. Just pretend it's looped. And um, you could have taken the bead and had it tied at the end and slip it through the loop and you could have it like that, like this. I'll take it off my wrist if I can get it off. See how, I actually have tassels on this one. This. See, I had it looped up here when I tied it instead of cutting it. And I tied the bead onto the end when it was all done, knotted it. I, you don't have to add the tassels, just pretend they're not there. And then the way you could wrap around your list and you could slip the bead through the loop and you have a bracelet like that. So, say bye. Bye, guys. Hope you enjoy. No? Off.